So we managed to get ourselves stabbed last episode and then we had to have a talk with Clementine about ladies growing up. This is what happens when we're in a zombie apocalypse. What's up guys and welcome to the channel, my name is JNO and welcome to another episode of The Walking Dead and New Frontier. We're on part 3 now of episode number 4 and we've just had a flashback with Clementine regarding when she had to leave AJ with the people at Richmond and Ava came and gave us some supplies and they had a chat about how she had to survive and all that kind of stuff. So now we're going back into Richmond I believe where we've managed to get some weapons and Clementine should be stitching us up. Then it, it might kick off, at least that's what I'm expecting to happen. So let's get into it. Going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. <sighs> so, what do you think? Seems like you did a good job, to be fair. I think I'm getting better. Nice work. Thanks. Just glad I could help. You coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. I'm worried she's doing something to Lingard. Oh, Lingard's awake. Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotting in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's... He's not getting out. What do you know, Guess Lingard? There's only one sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. That's my brother, Clem. Calm down. That, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up personal responsibility for that kid you say that like it's a good thing well it I is really surely doubt he was a positive influence david's the reason the kid's better off now than than he's ever been you can be as mad as you want about how about how things panned out clem is aj's family no kid is better off when you break their family apart maybe yeah you're i gotta right. stick up for clem Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I think that helps I a little bit, to be fair. what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? Uh-oh. Oh, tell me this isn't, like, really bad news. Are you going to shoot up again? You're telling you me... I, she couldn't take drugs for her kid. I just want to die. And I you're drugging you yourself up. Inject this into me. Hang in there. Tomorrow's another day. <sighs> I can't. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. He's not dead yet. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. Wait, I'm not killing him. For all I know, David's fine. You weirdo. I'm sorry, I mean, Clem, Clem, if you want to do it, this. you can. No, but I ain't I doing to. it. If you won't, I will. Clem, Fine, stop. do it. I'm, in his right I'm, mind. I'd actually, can't do I this. wouldn't stop him. Her, Let go but... of me. I'm taking the deal. We'll find AJ, just not this way. There is no other way. 
Where is... You can consider the deal. Oh. Oh, wow, that's a bit harsh. She said she'd no. do it. Javi! How could you? May I not kill in someone? So be it. It's your funeral. Especially now. Now that Jones rounding up all alleged traitors. You better hope she doesn't find you. Hang in there, buddy. Oh, hey. Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah, right back at you. Gabe was really you happy to see Clem there. Yeah, we're all set. Let's roll. Mm, good to see you. You okay? Yeah, it looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. She all right? So you got the guns, huh? We got them all right. One for you, and one for you. I Not one, this for, one you. for you. No, I've already got one. Oh, Clem. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. There we go. Thanks. Yay. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's gotta be a stressful job, looking after an entire community. He was definitely not 100% there, that's for sure. Sounds about right. Oh, Clem, I'm sorry, but I'm not killing someone. Why don't you go talk to Kate, okay? Okay. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. It's about There's, to there's go no going anywhere down. with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just because they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. Hey, we can do this. Yeah. We've gotten out of time. Yeah, okay. before, come on. haven't we? We I can mean, do this. Sure. But this is different. We can't just cut and run. Not with the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Now how the fuck are we going to put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. Really? Are they? So... She doesn't have a lieutenant do or that? something? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. The best way to get rid of Joan is to get David back on top. If he's in charge again, things will go back to the way they used to be. No arguments here. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been Please tell me it's right outside. Pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? Yep. You said it see the other guy. Bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? You're bleeding right through that bandage. Things went a little sideways at the end. Gabe got in the way. A guard came after me and he stabbed me in the shoulder. <sighs> I thought you guys were going to be careful out there. Hey. Wait. Don't worry about I it. I didn't want to. It is what it is. I wouldn't, didn't want to dog you Gabe in. You doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? Oh, it's fine. I'm sure Clem did a good job. As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Wow, well, that was a quick look. Such a big deal about it. It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make Whoa, sure Gabe. he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just give me a gun and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's going to be thinking. It's not a bad place to start. And it's good you want to help. We've got to talk it through before we settle on it. Gabe, I'm trying to be nice to you here. 
Not that I don't appreciate the can-do attitude, but I don't know if you're invited, little man. I think I agree with Trip. Ugh, this is bullshit! I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. No way anybody is dying. Not today. That's why we have to take the time to talk it through. So everybody comes out okay. Right, calm down, Gabe. Calm Nobody down. here is going to let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the time, oh, wow. he came after what? us. He tried to bargain with you. But you thought killing him would be easier. I saved your life, too, in case you didn't remember that part. So what? You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Oh, man. Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? Jeez. What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was going to shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger. No question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Wow. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? Oi, trip. I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. I'm sorry it happened the way it did. Really. Fuck Conrad sake. wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... Just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Well, that went to shit pretty quick, didn't it? I was just starting to like Gabe as well. Jeez. I'll tell you what, if there was a choice between saving Mariana and Gabe in the first episode, I know which one I'd have saved, and I think it would have been the right choice. Clem, Four seasons come in. Come with me to get the truck. Do not like Gabe. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. Yeah, I'm not going with you, Gabe. You'll start one of your stupid hissy fits. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did. Oh right? my god, Gabe, shut up. Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. Keeping watch is an important job, too. Not as important as getting that truck. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Wait, go on, yeah. Clem. Use your womenly okay. ways. What? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. <laughs> go, Clem. It's your birthday. No, I'm gonna go. No, don't. Don't wind him up. No need to look, there's just walkers there. What's going on? Thanks. For what? Helping out with Gabe. He's having a rough time. Clem is coming part of the family, isn't she? We all are. I'm just doing what I can. Cheers, Clem. You're a champ. Let's keep looking for that truck. You got it. Hmm. This thing looks like it moves too slow for an escape. 
I thought Thingy was getting the truck, but obviously I'm getting the truck. Guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area. Well, in that truck. Did I just walk straight past the truck? Oh, nah, I reckon the truck's in here, boy. Open the garage door, find the truck. There it is. Let's go. Hopefully there's no walkers inside. Or people. Or a cat. What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. Smart ass. Oh dear. Oh dear. Why have they come in? Early risers. Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we really? can get some distance between us and them. That's wishful thinking, isn't it? Whatever happens, don't have Kate get shot or something crazy. Alright, push! I was still tapping A for no reason. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? Oh my god, Gabe! Saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. I'm glad you were here, okay? At least you can Jeez. admit it. Yeah. Oh, Long Gabe, you are so annoying. Actually follow directions. Oh my god, I want to slap the kid. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. Well, I think I they probably still neutral. would, but... Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Am I good at hotwiring? I didn't know that was part Try of my school set. Yourself. Well, why don't you hotwire it then if I you're gonna be so judgmental? The wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? So now I've got to find tools. What's that over here? That's a toolbox, isn't it? Oh, I didn't even control that, I don't think. We want that to strip wires, don't we? Oh, snap! Alright. Jeez! Almost there. Keep an eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Be careful, Kate. Clint Please be careful. Okay, here goes. Wire cutter should help with this. Well, yep, that's why we picked them up. Do I cut them all? I don't know how to hot wire a car. Gotta connect the battery to the ignition. And if you looked at me and thought I had hot wired a car, it's naughty. Okay, so I didn't need to cut the first don't one. Get electrocuted. Have I fucked up? Let there be light. Oh, is the light a good idea?
Oh, great. No, 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 no. Well done, Javi. Oh, shit. That's exactly what we wanted. Please work. Javi, hurry up. Alright, jump in. Quick, guys, get in. Hey, let's go now. Ooh, don't get shot, Clem. Keep your foot down. Those two guys, I hope they've got enough ammo because I feel a bit bad if they're going to die because of me. Anyway guys, we're going to call it there for this episode. Thank you so much for tuning in as always. I should really get to bed because I've got work early tomorrow morning. But if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that like button. I've been JNO, you guys have been awesome. And remember, have fun gaming.